Welcome. Chronic degeneration, chronic degenerative arthritis, chronic facet syndrome. Look at the cervical spine. Look at the discs, how they separate the vertebrae. In the back of the cervical spine, you have facet joints. These are the bones sit on top of each other. Realize that when there is forward head posture, rounded shoulders, the weight of the head multiplies excessively, putting excessive load and stress on the discs as well as the joints of the spine. When this happens, the body then goes through what we call osteoblastic activity. The body starts to bring in more calcium and starts to make further changes within the joints as a result of the unstable joints. Therefore, the body tries to compromise and compensate for this instability that the spine is going through. As a result of this, the joints become inflamed. They start to heal. They then start to develop what we call osteoarthritis, degenerative joint disease. The joints, the cartilage starts to go through changes where it's no longer smooth. Now it starts to become roughened. As it becomes roughened, those joints start to degenerate more and more as a result of the excessive weight and the load from the incorrect postural stability. So the question that comes up quite often is, what do I do when I have neck pain? Where do I go? Well, many people will go to a chiropractor, to a physical therapist, to other therapists, to, to put movement into the neck, to stretch the neck, to manipulate the neck, to adjust the neck. As well as you may right now be listening that you may be moving your own neck and stretching your own neck and adjusting your own neck and maybe you're thinking it's good for you. But although I just want to set a very important word out to the community out there as well as the world that when you have advanced degenerative arthritis and you start putting movement in there you're disrupting the body's ability to stabilize something that was weak prior so therefore you put a force and you start put a sudden change into something that the body is trying to stabilize it then starts to erupt and then the symptoms get a lot worse a lot harder to correct so therefore, you have to understand that when you have advanced degeneration, arthritic changes, the body's trying to stabilize, the body's trying to compromise, it's trying to comp compensate as a result of that instability. The body will do its best to stabilize it, but although it will never be 100%. So a uh, word of wisdom is be careful. I would not recommend uh, manipulation or forceful stretching or anything that's going to cause that disruption of the body trying to, to, to solidify and trying to hold itself as it's trying to stabilize itself. And be careful with the things that you do every day, the sports, the lifting the weights, the lifting the shoulders up, uh, the prolong, uh, whatever you're doing with your arms out in front of you, lifting uh, the, the, head, the head going forward, the shoulders rounded forward leaning forward all those constant stresses can be aggravating what the body's trying to preserve when it's trying to heal the best way it can so i hope that for what it's worth you gain some knowledge i ask you to share the video subscribe if you haven't leave your questions below and most important make it a great day i'm dr alan mandel